Laws of Chemical Combinations The combination of elements to form compounds is governed by the five basic laws. They are Law of Conservation of Mass Law of Definite Proportions Law of Multiple Proportions Gay-Lussac's Law of Gaseous Volumes Avogadro Law Now, let us take Law of Conservation of Mass. This law was put forth by Antoine Lavoisier in 1789. This law states that mass in an isolated system is neither created nor destroyed by chemical reactions or physical transformations. This law also states that the mass of the products in a chemical reaction must equal the mass of the reactants. For example, when two hydrogen combines with one oxygen to form water, here, two hydrogen and one oxygen were reactant whereas the water is a product. On calculating and comparing, the total mass of reactant and product were equal. This law was given by, a French chemist, Joseph Proust. This law states that, the compound always contains exactly the same proportion of elements by weight. For example, let's take bottle water and tap water. On comparing both there is same compound same ratio of 2 is 2 1 and same mass percents. Thus proves the law of definite proportions. Let us take law of multiple proportions. This law was proposed by Dalton in 1803. This law states that if two elements can combine to form more than one compound, the masses of one element that combine with a fixed mass of the other element, are in the ratio of small whole numbers. For example, let's take dihydrogen monoxide and hydrogen peroxide. On comparing both, ratio of oxygen is 1 is 2 2 which is in the ratio of small whole numbers. Thus proves the law of multiple proportions. Let us take Gay-Lussac's law of gaseous volumes. This law was given by Joseph Louis Gay-Lussac in 1808. This law states that, when gases combine or are produced in a chemical reaction they do so in a simple ratio by volume provided all gases are at same temperature and pressure. For example, let's take 100 ml of hydrogen and 50 ml of oxygen, which is combines to form 100 ml of water, which is 2 is 2 1 ratio that is simple ratio by volume provided all gases are at same temperature and pressure. Gay-Lussac's discovery of integer ratio and volume relationship is actually the law of definite proportions by volume, but law of definite proportion was with respect to mass. Let us take Avogadro law. The Gay-Lussac's law was explained properly by the work of Avogadro in 1811. Avogadro proposed that equal volumes of gases at the same temperature and pressure should contain equal number of molecules. For example, let two volumes of hydrogen react with one volume of oxygen to give two volumes of water vapor. We see that two volumes of hydrogen combine with one volume of oxygen to give two volumes of water without leaving any unreacted oxygen. Thank you for watching. Visit us at needbook.in